Okay, so here's how to put a uh, custom keyboard on your Android tablet. So basically you're going to go to the market, we're going to search for keyboard, and then the word either tablet or honeycomb, because there are other keyboards on here, but they're meant for use on a uh, on a regular Android phone and they don't display properly, so you got to have that other keyword to be able to find the ones that will work on your tablet. So you can check them out. This one's actually pretty good, the tablet keyboard that's free. And what it does is it splits the keyboard so that you can use it while holding it like this. So that's kind of cool. Let's do that. You're just going to click download, click OK, and wait for that to install. OK, so once you install any Android keyboard, regardless of which one it is, you have to go to settings language and input and we're going to enable it so we're going to go down to configure input methods tablet keyboard click OK or whatever the name of your new keyboard is so that it's checked this way it's allowed to be used now we go into anywhere that we type in text so for example the browser and if you tap there's a little keyboard button that shows up down here at the bottom on an Android tablet. We're going to tap that. And it'll give us the different options to use. So now we have the tablet keyboard that we just downloaded, or whatever keyboard you just downloaded. Tap back in here. And now we have that new keyboard. We click this button to split it. And it'll work the same with any keyboard that you download off the market. So there you go. Now to go back to the keyboard that you originally had, all you have to do is click on this keyboard button down here at the bottom again and then switch back to the other keyboard. Now you can also uninstall the keyboard that you downloaded by going to settings, applications, manage applications and then you'll find it in here. There it is, tablet keyboard free, uninstall. And there you go.